All right, coming up next, it is a welterweight showdown between Dana White and Khabib Nurmagomedov. So here he is, the Dagestani combat sambo master, Khabib Nurmagomedov. Used to wrestle bears as a kid, and he's been equally successful against human beings, undefeated thus far. Most takedowns in a single UFC fight took Abel Trujillo down 21 times on 27 attempts, Joe. And that was a three-round fight. More often than not, when this man wants you on your back, that's exactly where he'll put you. And if you want to get up, best of luck to him. This guy is an outstanding wrestler, and what he wants to do here is avoid any striking confrontations, close the distance, grab a hold of his opponent, and bring the fight down to the ground where he should have an advantage. shortage of call-outs as you would expect since UFC President Dana White announced his intentions to compete inside the octagon and when you break down the film on White hard not to like what you see the hands they are heavy you do not want to stand on a napkin in the center of the octagon and trade with this guy he is an outstanding boxer he can lean on the takedown defense if need be to keep the fight upright Dana White looking to get his hands on the opposition early and often here tonight this guy is an excellent boxer, and if the fight takes place standing, he will have a distinct advantage with his striking skill. Our tail of the tape for this highly anticipated welterweight fight. Well, how about the age discrepancy here? More than 15 years apart with similar height and some differences in reach. All right, now to get us started, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Ben Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. It's time! Five in the UFC walk away division. This is the first fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a grappler. Holding professional record on. 26 wins, no losses. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighed in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of the Republic of Dagestan, Russia, Habib the Evil Magomedov! And now, if you see his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a boxer making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Las Vegas, Nevada, Dana Clyde! All right, can't give you losing the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. I want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, come back to your corners, come out fighting. All right, here we go. I am fired up for this fight. It's been a long time coming, and they're finally going to get after right. it. Well, it is a venue that has hosted some of the biggest fights in combat sports history, and we are back for war, ready to go with live action underway here at the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. Well, everybody wants to get a crack at the boss, UFC President Dana White, but perhaps it's a case of be careful what you wish for. You know about the boss. Oh! He's got him hurt here. Could get really interesting. Oh, well placed with the hammer fist there by Nurmago Medov. And busy as he looks to improve position here. Oh, 
Trying to spin to the back. He's doing a great job of moving and transitioning here on the ground. Moved into half guard. He's got the arm trapped of his opponent. Good defense in half guard. And he lands a hammer fist. Excellent movement and transitions here on the ground. Staying busy. He grabbed the north-south choke here. He's got that choke locked in nice. I believe he's in all kinds of trouble now. This choke continues to get tighter every second. He may be forced to tap. Outstanding. Outstanding. He got the choke for the tap. Well, yeah, Joe, he told us during fight week he's been working dutifully on his submission game and he was going to look for an opening here tonight. Safe to say he found one near-perfect setup on the choke. It was sunk in deep, and his opponent had no choice but to tap out or go to sleep. And here's the end of the fight. And here we can see it again. That's a real tight choke here. And one more time, nice technique here on this submission. So there he is, your winner by submission. That is a finish they will likely be talking about for some time. Big win, major statement made to the rest of this division. Now we go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Bergliotta is going to stop in this contest at three minutes, 14 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by tap out, Habib So nearly 30 men have tried, and as yet, no one has solved the puzzle. That is the Dagestani Khabib Nurmagomedov proving to be, if not the best, one of the best lightweights in the world. And again, when the striking starts to catch up with the wrestling, this is a guy who is going to be even more